Hey guys, today I want to talk to you about the importance of labels in our modern music industry with stuff like Bandcamp and so forth, self-distribution, etc. And I really think that the meaning of a label completely changed over the course of maybe the last five years, but also the last 10 and 20 years from being an absolutely substantial part of distributing music to actually being something more secondary today. Um, if I think about it, really, labels are kind of optional. Today, the artist is everything, so every person can be a brand. We see that a lot with YouTube influencers, etc. That's much more important than it was before. Now, the individual is much stronger than, let's say, the collective. That's not to say that a label can help you gain access to proper distribution and promotion very fast. And today, I think, especially in some niche markets, it's also that labels provide not only services in distribution, but also actually gig handling. At least I know a couple of labels in the niche that I am working with where this is provided. Today, from the perspective of a niche market, it's really much more about yeah having a strong group of people that stands behind you and basically yeah it should, should be a very close bond in that group in my opinion and labels are as i said not as important they have less market value actually i would say so it's easier to get to one also there are more net labels than ever literally thousands and thousands are flooding the market with low quality releases and low quality music we live in a day and age where everybody has access to those tools and this is great because it enables everybody to actually put creative stuff out and what's not to love about that that somebody in a favela in rio de janeiro could actually become an edm star or a graphic designer one day just simply because he has the access to internet and to a pc that's definitely a great thing but overall i would say yeah the market value of of labels is is much much more secondary than it ever has been and even if i go back only five to ten years it's it's already so dramatically different i mean Right now, for everybody who is looking for a label, I, I really tell the people to actually better wait and see if they really can find a group that stands behind their music, because that, that's obviously very important. And that's not always the case. I can really, really talk out of experience there. Don't push yourself in this direction, okay? Rather look for real friends basically or a very very strong vision that appeals to you then of course do it and yeah there are labels which will give you higher market value maybe on a short term base you know you can gain quicker success but in the end it's all about you and your art and what you are doing with it so stay focused on that stay focused on being great as an individual and not as a group also it might be that if you join a label and if you basically die for that label then it is literally so if the label will go down one day you will maybe go down with it so yeah i don't know that that was just a little video of random thoughts about labels in 2018 and what they mean to the music industry it was yeah it's more like a vlog so i'm just talking free of my head Obviously, it's, it might be a little bit confused, but yeah, there are my thoughts. And yeah, if you want to see more stuff about those themes like the music industry and um, music production as well, but more videos of those and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you want to see more. I'm trying to produce more of those videos for you in the upcoming weeks. And I'm going to see you guys soon. Bye bye.